Hi, it's me again with Crow Roll Tips and Tricks Part 2. And the one I'm trying to help, I actually recontoured it to the inside the point one to get us right on the edge of our graphic. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you could actually get down in these parts of the horse. To do this, your horse, your graphic needs to be grouped together. You have to have it grouped together for this to work. Because we're going to be moving some stuff around. Take the Smart Fill tool. I'll just leave it on that green. Smart Fill that, 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 that. You know, even this. And I wouldn't go any further than that. Um, you could actually Smart Fill that. Um, probably that part of the leg. But I wouldn't do any more. Now, take your logo... Well, we couldn't go grab it. So I'm going to move the logo up. Now you see we have these smart field places. Well, now take the smart field tool and let's make it blue. Fill that in and see it's it won't go in those spaces that we filled. Now I'm going to left click, right click. I'm going to go ahead and delete this. So I won't make a mess. Now I can move this over and up. And now our cut line is right on top of that black line. Now, with that being said, if you wanted just a little bit of an edge, you know, a little bit more to cut around but still have the shape of the horses, we could go to effects and contour to the outside. Let's go like 0.05. That's too much. Let's go uh, 0 0.01. Forget how little this is. Go up to effects. Break the contour apart. Normally, when you click, you get the inside contour. So, see, that's the original. Here's the new one on the outside. So, you have a little bit of a lip cut, more so all the way around, but it conforms to the horse where the one we did earlier did not. I guess I deleted it. Anyway, pretty simple. Just go through those steps and you're well on your way. Hope that helped. Thank you for watching.